What's up masters? Thank you so much for coming to my channel, to, to this new video. Today I'm going to show you some uh, strategies about how can you grow your image list, about lead generation. Okay. But uh, first to jump into this strategy, if this is your first time in my channel, remember to subscribe and hit the notification. Uh, leave thumbs up, leave comments. Um, I really like uh, answering your, your comments and it really helps uh, growing this channel and make more videos like this every single day. So um, let's just start to, uh, with this strategy about lead generation. Um, this strategy basically consists on building a break-even funnel. Okay, so what is a break-even funnel? It's a strategy used to grow an, an audience for virtually free. Okay, and I want to explain right now what is that virtually. Um, a break-even funnel is designed to um, I can show you a picture right now. Um, a break-even funnel is is designed to um, pay for your advertising. Okay, so for example, uh, we start right here in a Facebook ad. This can be a different ad if your audience is on Instagram or is if your audience is on LinkedIn or if you prefer Google Ads, it's okay. Uh, this is just an example. I, I really prefer Facebook ads for, for my niche. Um, we set up an ad on any of the platforms that um, we can use um, with the objective to uh, send traffic to an opt-in page. Okay, what is actually our lead generation um, page. Uh, let's point uh, with this. Okay, so we send the traffic to an opt-in page where uh, they are going to leave an email and a name um, usually for giving them some valuable information after this, uh, this opt-in, okay? Um, once you have, once we have collected this, this email and the name, this, these people are actually our leads. We are going to add them to an email list or any of the autoresponders that you can use like uh, Facebook Pons or Aweber or uh, wherever. And then we are going to send them directly to a bridge page. In this bridge page, um, if you can uh, make a video about, um, about the product that you are going to sell um, right after the, this page, um, you can set up a, you can uh, record a welcome product, a congratulations product, and then tell them something about the, the product um, on the next page, and then um, push, uh, locate a, a button um, below the, the video, uh, that is actually a call to action uh, button. Uh, when your traffic uh, click on this button, they will be redirected to a product sales page. In the case that um, people just close this page or, or they maybe just lost the connection, the internet connection, you are going to set up an email sequence to um, send them again to their bridge page and then to the product page. Uh, product sales page. Some autoresponders have a um, card abandon uh, option, uh, used to be paid option, but if you have that you can actually know if, if, if your traffic has um, clicked on this button or if they have just um, closed this page or closed this, this other page. Um, so you can send them different emails and more will be more 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 personalized, more customized to your lead. So more willingly to make a, a sale. Okay. Um, after this bridge page, uh, we are going to locate um, let's say a ten ten dollar product. And after this um, this front-end sales, uh, we are going to locate, for example, uh, $30 products, uh, 
an upsell uh, product, okay? And then after that, uh, find a thank you page, or if you want another um, upsell, if it's related with the front-end uh, product. Um, these products are, can maybe be um, affiliate products, but um, have in mind that if it's an affiliate product, usually you are not going to uh, have more than the 50% of the price of the product, okay? 50, top is, uh, uh, used to be uh, 75%, something like that. So just keep that in mind, because this is going to actually pay for your uh, advertising. The money that you're going to collect on this, uh, these two pages is the money that is you are going to place right here in these ads, okay? Um, so you need to make your, your calculations very, very carefully. Um, most, most likely the first ad campaign that you're going to set up, set, set up is going to be just for test, so lost, lost money. Um, because you need to test uh, the opt-in page, the bridge page, and all the, the, the product page and the, and the thank you page to know exactly um, how much money you, can you collect on those pages or how much traffic can you attract um, for this particular offer. But uh, once you have tested this, this strategy, um, with these two pages, you are going to pay for the advertisements, for, for the ads on your platform, and then generate um, leads directly to your, um, to your autoresponder uh, virtually for free, because it's going to be paid for the, from these um, affiliate sales or for your own sales. Uh, if you have your own product, uh, perfect because you can take the 100% of commission, okay? Um, so, uh, this is the strategy for, for today, guys. Um, if you want to boost this uh, strategy, what I recommend is not actually using Facebook ads or Google ads or Instagram ads or, or LinkedIn ads, for example. Um, if you really want to collect a lot of uh, leads in a reduced um, time frame, what you should do is go for uh, solo ads, okay? But not any solo ad. Take care for with the what some all of all solo ad vendors because they say that they can um, give you, uh, for example, 500 clicks for 100 dollars and most, most probably those uh, clicks will be uh, bots or maybe with uh, fake emails. So it's not what you want, okay? What you want is real people um, leaving real email on your opt-in page. So um, there are just a, actually a few solo ad vendors that give you that uh, quality on the on your leads um, so and they have usually a, a, a price between one to two dollars per click okay so you need to make a budget for for that but also um, they may give you some guarantee about the um, email opt-ins that you are going to Collect, okay, uh, so I, I have actually one one solo ad vendor in mind. Um, if you want to know more uh, about him, just leave a comment down below, and I will be happy to to point you in in the right direction. That um, it's a bit expensive, uh, obviously. The price is 1.5 more or less uh, dollar for, for per uh, per click, but they guarantee that you are going to collect at least. 30% uh, on, on opt-ins, but they have statistics that say they actually they collect more opt-ins than that. So if you're maybe uh, buying uh, 500 clicks, for example, uh, it's more probably that you are going to get 200 leads um, in just a reduced time frame, maybe a week, 
uh, a month if you want, but 200 leads that you can um, convert into buyers with this um, with this break even funnel, okay, and pay for that advertising and keep going on and going on and keep growing your email list. The bigger your email list is, the more um, you can redirect them to other products in the future, to uh, YouTube videos if you are growing a YouTube channel, or to new posts if you are uh, working on a, on a blog, for example. So the bigger your list is, the more money you can make from from that list, okay? Um, this is all for today, guys. I hope you uh, understand this, uh, this break-even uh, funnel strategy. Uh, if you have any question, leave a comment in the section below and I will be happy to respond to you. Uh, leave thumbs up and remember to subscribe to my channel. It really helps uh, growing it and keep, um, I keep uh, shooting more videos like this every single day. Thank you so much, guys, and see you on my next video.